Hey guys, what is up? This is Micro Arcader Boy, and uh, first of all, before this video begins, I would like to thank you guys for 1,000 subscribers. That is crazy. Like, I didn't really expect to reach that at all, to be honest, but you guys have made that possible, and I would like to thank you. But anyways, <clears throat> Today we're going to be playing a uh, VR game. You may have heard of it. It's called Face Your Fears, and uh, it's never really played it, to be honest. I mean, like, I've played, like, I don't know, maybe, like, a couple minutes of it, then I quit. Because uh, I had to go do something. But now I am back, and I'm going to play it, and hopefully I don't need a new pair of pants by the end of this. Anyways, let's get into the video. Hey guys, this is Micro Arcader Boy, or Alex, and will these doors please stop opening? <laughs> Anyways, will you stop? This... This is Micro Arcader Boy, or Alex, and today we're going to be playing Face Your Fears. And from what I've heard, this game is pretty scary. And, uh, I'm very excited for that. Okay, I'm just... Making sure you guys can hear me. That would be bad if you couldn't. Anyways, so it's recommended that you play this VR game sitting down, so I'm gonna. And without, but without any further ado, let's get into the first level. Okay, they recommend. Now you recommend standing. <laughs> you know what? I'm still gonna sit anyways, cause I'm a rebel. <laughs> Not really. Now, I'm not sure exactly what's in this level. I played it a, a long time ago. Like, several months. Right, I forgot about that guy. I'm losing all. That would be the mic. Uh, hi there, um... I don't appreciate this. Whoa, okay, so this is a height one, I'm assuming. And to be honest, I'm not really as scared of heights. So, this should not be a problem at all. Okay, oh my gosh. VR heights, not my forte. Not gonna lie, the robot isn't that scary, though. That's really disorienting. like that. Uh oh. Please don't kill me. Ah! Okay. We're good. That ain't good. You just gonna leave me out here? Uh... Is that a UFO? It looks like a UFO. Also, if the audio is quiet, I'm sorry. I... Or if my microphone is quiet, because I'm not facing directly towards it. For most of this. And we're dead, I think. That wasn't that scary. Not gonna lie, this one looks a lot more scary, though. <laughs> well, okay, yeah, now they, rec now they recommend sitting.
Ooh. Which story should we go with? What does that say? Sorry, the resolution on these headsets is not what it not what it is for you guys. So I can't exactly read that. I mean like I can, but I have trouble. Fun with jingle, I think that says. Sure, let's go with that. I'm not really afraid of clowns, so. Come join the circus with me. Hello, murder clown. Swing this. Oh, you're still there. I think I just hit the mic. <laughs> Now that's a little more creepy. And the clown is gone. You know, it's not so much clowns I'm afraid of, it's more haunted dolls. <clears throat> that happen to be clowns. Is that a clown? I think that's a clown. Hi there, buddy. <laughs> okay, that's a terrifying demon child, I think. Um, not really my forte. You know, I, uh, would like to get out of here now. Um, I'm not a... Not afraid of clowns, I am afraid of haunted jack-in-the-boxes, though, and not the restaurant. Actually, the restaurant isn't that good either, but that is especially not good. I wanna be with what are you doing with the scissors there, pal? Can't say I like the fact that he's holding scissors. Or that that is now next to me. I feel like I'm playing Five Nights at Freddy's right now. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't- WHOA! Can we not do that, please? Okay, that was legitimately terrifying. Having virtual scissors fly at your face is not exactly comforting, even if they are virtual. Can't say I liked that either. Terrifying demon children are definitely now a fear of mine. Now we're going with the ghost, I think that said. Also, the way you interact with things in this game is not my favorite. You look at it with your headset, then you press a button. Terrifying demon child, please get out of my room. That is very rude of you to just barge in here while I'm sleeping. Or at least trying to sleep. I can't sleep anymore now that you've done that. Uh... No, don't like that. I especially don't like that. Terrifying demon child, please don't. I don't like your eyes. I... This terrifying demon child is very, well, terrifying.
uh, door. I don't like that. Um, get me away from that, please. Oh my gosh. This is so much scarier in VR than I bet it is in 2D. Like just watching it on like your phone or whatever you're watching this on. Uh, terrifying demon child, please don't. Okay, if you weren't terrifying enough, you're now a spider, which are also equally as terrifying. I don't like the fact that that door is open. Like, I, I don't. Also, I'm probably not pointing at it for you guys, but for me, I'm pointing directly at it. Terrifying demon child, get away from me, please. This is fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah, I'm fine for sure. I am no longer fine. I'm gonna need that new pair of pants now. Uh, okay. Um, what was that for? You trash in my room now? Just leave me alone so I can sleep. Well, I can't sleep anymore because you've terrified me beyond belief, but you know. Uh, hi there, terrifying demon child. Uh, can I? <gasps> okay. Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Shouldn't have eaten Taco Bell before this. <clears throat> anyway. Uh, light as a feather, I think that says, I think I'm touching the microphone right now, but I honestly can't, yeah, I'm definitely touching it. See what I mean about this interaction, though? Like, my hands are useless, I just need them to press that. What's gonna be light as a feather here? Is it me? Because I don't think I'm light as a feather, I'm like... I weigh way more than a feather, I can tell you that much. Uh, door, please don't. I don't like that at all. Or that. And now the door and the cabinets are closed. Those aren't cabinets, Alex. Those are drawers. This probably isn't the kind of conversation I should be having with myself right now, considering that my house is haunted. Uh, I don't care for this one bit. Uh, it's gonna happen now. Is that it? It's not very scary, dude. C terrifying little demon child. You, not scary at all. Actually, is this the terrifying demon child anymore? Well, if it was, thank you for turning my fan on. It was getting real hot in here. I don't like that, either. That's another thing that I don't like. Uh, yeah, that's certainly another thing that I don't care for. Um, I swear, something's gonna come flying at my face right now, I know it. 
and it's gonna be freaking terrifying. I knew it. Uh, I can't say that I like this either. It's fine. There's just a mini tornado from the ceiling fan. That's all. Okay. Was not expecting that. Can't say I was expecting that. This is creepy. I don't like this. Um, is this some sort of like prank? Am I getting pranked right now? Because I don't think any prank involves throwing scissors at someone's face. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Does anyone have any money? I need some new pants. What the? No, I'd... I'd rather you didn't finish that. The terrifying demon child's gonna pop out, isn't he? I know it. I'm calling it. I'm like clenching onto the controllers right now, like... <laughs> yep! I knew it. Why am I back here? I completed all the stories. Is there something else to do now? Can I go to sleep? I don't think I can go to sleep. Is there anything else I can do? <clears throat> I'm not sure there's anything else I can do here. Um, uh, do I just keep doing this? Hold on, give me one second. Yeah, so I've done some research on if there's anything else to do here, and, uh, I don't think there is. I think this is... I mean, maybe I can do one of these again. Maybe. I don't know. I'm gonna go with, uh, the ghost. Sure. That was probably my favorite one. Okay, terrifying spider demon children. Why am I getting scared? I've already done this. Is it for views? It might be for views. He's definitely viewing me, that's for sure. Hello, terrifying spider demon child. Alright guys, well that was it for Face Your Fears, at least for today. It, that was probably it, to be honest. <laughs> Honestly, it's probably one of my favorite VR games that I've played, but it, I mean, for a free VR game, it's, it's pretty good. But I felt like it could have used more. Like, it doesn't really have a whole lot of game content, I guess. But anyways... I thought it was pretty good, and, uh, definitely they should sell pants, because, uh, I need some new ones. Anyways, uh, bye guys, I will see you in a future video or stream. See ya!